Hey everybody, Bobcat here, live in the Art Minds, and time to do a product review. Yay! This is the Maxpedition Fat Boy Versa Pack. This is my favorite purse. And let me tell you, I've actually had this purse for a long ass time. I keep, I'm gonna keep calling it a purse because purse is an old word. Like Shakespeare old, screw that. This is my favorite purse. And don't stick man purse in front of it unless you go to your man bathroom and take a man dump that is separate somehow from any other bathroom or any other dump you take. I don't wanna hear it. My favorite purse. This was about a hundred bucks and I bought it with the intention of eventually someday getting a good camera to go in it. But this is uh, one of those tactical everyday carry, whatever you wanna call it. It's also a holster, so if you're one of those uh, concealed carry type people, this may work really well for you. I'm not, not yet, maybe never, but it has this back compartment here, really good sturdy zipper, and then inside here, and I'll do some close-up stuff, I'll show you, it's got a Velcro on one side, so if you have a holster that's got a Velcro uh, attachment on it, it'll stuff down in and fit really securely on there. Um, it also has a strip of the, and this is all the fuzzy, the soft fuzzy side of Velcro, and it has the soft fuzzy side right here. For if you have a name stripe, any kind of patch or something you need to put on, take it off, stick it right there. And then another small pouch that I use mostly for changing earplugs. Uh, inside the main compartment, there is, and I'll zoom in on this. So you've got this, they call it a rain fly, I think. Uh, I have the, I'll throw the, website up uh, right here, but has this this water resistant, it's not waterproof by any means, but it, it will help slow the rain down. Um, it's got this cover here, and then inside, you actually have two mesh webbed pouches on the inside of there. And on one side, got a nice zipper thing that's actually perfect for the cell phone mount and mini tripod I use for taking a lot of videos in the field. That slips right in here. Uh, on this side, this is pretty heavy duty. Um, I usually keep my asthma inhaler in here or uh, you know one of these Leatherman type things for when on the road, stuff it in. And it has another pouch. They called this a cell phone pouch. I haven't seen a cell phone that could fit this since the 90s, but uh, it works really well for the digital audio recorder that I keep stuffed in here. It's got places for a couple pens on that. Um, a nice, where is it on this side? Nice hook for your key ring, uh, that kind of stuff. Um, I've used this to hook it and hang it from things. Carrying handle or hanging handle. And then on the front, another pouch with an open pocket here and then zips up inside here and here. Uh, wallet, keys, uh, camera batteries for me usually is fit in here, microphone, that kind of stuff. Um, but when I'm on the motorcycle, this is perfect because I can fit my zoom lens and the camera body really easily in here in the main pocket. Clips on. You can cinch it tight. I've got my tripod, my other clips here. And then this will fit over my motorcycle jacket and it's beautiful. And if I'm dumb and put my helmet on first, this it's a nice latch. So I can reach around my giant head, clip this on, and then this is gonna mess up the audio. Then it has another, this is going right over the microphone and I'm really sorry. This has another like waist strap thing here. So when you're going down the road at exactly the posted speed limit, this bag stays nice and secure over your jacket. Um, it's perfect for, for art and photography and motorcycles all together. 100 bucks, um, I beat this the crap out of this bag. I've used it in behind the scenes theater production work, climbing up in the, you know, in the rafters and in the pipes, and I've got tools and stuff, you know, small tools. It is the Fat Boy VersaPack. Doesn't look like they've changed the design since I've got it, and I can't really think of a thing I would change about it. Uh, again, about a hundred bucks, tough as hell, incredibly useful, and should someday, you know, I ever need to conceal carry or any of that kind of crap, it'll work. So yeah, when I go out with my camera stuffed in here and then in 
The back here, I can put another small notebook, my cell phone, my wallet, and have everything I need right here to go. Uh, I do not get paid by these people. I do not ask their permission to do anything. This is purely my opinion based on years of abuse of this fantastic, very fashionable purse. Uh, the little glow in the dark dot was a, uh, a leftover from backstage, and frankly, I like it. And if you are the kind to put in pins and things like that, you got plenty of room to decorate it. Uh, it did come with a uh, little shoulder strap pad to kind of take the weight off, but that thing slid around and got on my nerves, so I just took it off. But yeah, 100 bucks. Oh yeah, another thing. This has all of these little, like, uh, mole, mole, versatile, whatever, all of these points that you can clip on and tie down to more tie down points than a shibari party at a rock climbing festival. I thought about saying that all day long. I hope this finds you in good health. Uh, I would highly recommend this. And uh, yeah, thank you for hanging out for another product review of my fabulous purse.